Hello, hello today. I'm going to show you how to detect your area where you can dock your OBD2 scanner into your smartphone 2 and how to remove the DLCs out of the storage. So let's start. We are on the driver's side and open the door and then we can locate the OBD2 port in um, the area where the pedals are built in of this car. Here you can see on the left side of the vehicle you see there is a cover and underneath the cover you can find the OBD2 scanner um, but this is um, placed there by me okay and if you have an OBD2 scanner you can dock this OBD2 scanner in the right direction to this port. If you do that the OBD2 scanner will be enabled automatically because the OBD2 port um, has an electrical, uh, electrical um, supplement. So let's have a seat and then we can see the scanner is on. But to get information about our health data of our car we have to switch on the ignition. We does not need to uh, start the engine, it is enough if we start the ignition process. And then we go and look what kind of OBD2 scanner you have. You can choose, for example, in um, a lot of um, OBD2 scanners, you can see the uh, car vehicle identification numbers. You can see the battery power. Um, you can see um, live data, um, freeze frame data, and so on. And of course, you can go to e OBD or OBD2 to enter into the system. Of course, the um, um, scanner is nearly the same on the market. There are buttons on it. You can navigate and you can enter into the system. And if you uh, if, if you are in, you can um, read. And after you read the failure code, then you can, of course, delete them. That means if you read a code, um, there is a, um, a number and this number will tell you what is broken in your car. Then you can fix that problem. And after you uh, fix that problem, you can go to clear DTCs. So the first step is read DTCs. And then if you fix the prop or you like to uh, maintain and have a look and check out after this process, you can clear DTCs to clear all DTCs out of the memory. And then, if everything is fixed, no new DTCs will be enabled in your scanner. Of course, additional parts are already there. As you can see here, freeze frame and, 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 and live data and something else. And after the process is done, you can remove the ODB2 scanner from your car. And then it is, you can go back on the street with the fixed car again and uh, your DTCs are deleted as well. Really cool. Thanks for watching. Um, please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback and I hope to see you again on my channel. Soon, soon.